Interactive 360-degree videos offer a complete panoramic view. You can change the perspective at any point of the video. To do so, click on the video image and drag the image in the other direction. This also works during playback. To import a 360-degree video, first create a 360-degree project. The video monitor will be switched to the interactive 360-degree view. Only a section of the entire image material is shown in the 360-degree view. You can switch the 360-degree display on and off using the video monitor menu. Load your 360-degree video. Three sixty degree cameras film using multiple lenses simultaneously in order to capture all perspectives. If you load data from a three sixty degree camera, individual image sources must first be mixed. This process is, is called stitching. To do this, open the three sixty degree stitching tab in the media pool. Here you can mix image sources to receive a whole image. In the right monitor, you will see the complete image material in normal 2D representation. The current stitching result will be displayed on the left monitor. First, check if there is a suitable preset for your 360 degree camera. Using the sliders in the dialog, you can manually mix both images until you get a fused image. In the left monitor, click on the image and change the angle by holding the mouse button to check the stitching from another perspective. You can edit a 360 degree video just like any other in the timeline. You can also apply video effects as usual. For titles, the program automatically switches back to the normal 2D view. You will see the complete image material of the 360 degree videos on the video monitor. It will appear severely distorted. Write your title and position it roughly on the image. Then switch back to 360 degree view. The title has will now be placed at a specific spot in the 360 degree panorama. It is only visible from certain perspectives. To position it exactly in the 360 degree panorama, use the dialog 360 degree editing. Next, activate 360 degree editing and select the object positioning mode. You can move the title in the area using the alignment button. To export a 360 degree video, select the Video as MPEG-4 option in the File menu. This export format offers more presets for 360 degree videos. 360 degree videos can contain a lot of image files and this can cause juddery playback on some smartphones. If in doubt, select a smaller format. 360 degree videos can also be used as normal videos. To do this, go into 360 degree mode and select the perspective that you wish to use in advance. To get to this, switch back to the 360 degree editing dialog. Activate 360 degree editing and select the mode Select Section from Panorama. You can change the direction of view using the Alignment button. Using the keyframe animation, you can even program the observer's movements. The camera perspective will then continuously change. This option is suited to filming a 360 degree landscape recording with a simulated tracking shot.
When you're done with the 360-degree editing, export the 360-degree film as a normal video.